JSAC at Takari at Lockheed Martin in Denver. Hello to all of you. To Air and Space in Every and uh, to the local French Vienna sites, to our industrial partners, ESA and Kness, and to all of you following on the internet. À tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top Allumage moteur Vulcan. Allumage EAP et décollage VA 252. Propulsion nominale. Mission accomplished. So we'll be getting rid of those boosters right now. Here we go. Waiting for confirmation. Will, you see it on the screen. The has, des has has it. You see what it looks launch. like up there. There is another. There are, of course, two boosters. There's one falling away out of camera range. Tell me why, Josh. It's because the satellites are going into geostationary orbit, and that is the speed, roughly, Largage at which the point. Earth turns. In space and the eighth launched for the nation of Korea. We're awaiting confirmation of the cutoff of lower stage, and you have it. On the animation, you saw the engine shut down, and there is separation. And you'll watch the nozzle, and it lights up. There you have ignition of the EPC. upper stage. You see the lower stage falling. Arian Space also launched the first Kari satellite in 2010. I think that was mentioned. A telecom ocean observation and weather satellite set to orbit another CompSat in the years ahead. Comsat 2A has a weather payload and a space environment payload. All this, of course, programmed in advance. The information is in the onboard computer. The launcher knows precisely what it has to do, where it is, and where it's going at all times. Satellites progress. Tonight, representing years of work for many of these people. Separation du satellite Geocomsat 2B. Ah! 